changed in design for almost 100 years. Now we've got man-made materials, but the design itself isn't that much different than the old-fashioned straw brooms that great-grandmother was using, or even earlier, back to the days of the Civil War. At $24.78, this is called the Wisp. It's not shaped like a regular broom. It works differently than a regular broom. And by the way, these folks redesigned the dustpan as well. We introduced this a while back. Thousands of them have been purchased by our QVC audience, and they originally were in one color. That was the blue. Yes. Then you came out of the gray. Today right. we're launching two decorator colors, yes. but I know we don't have a lot of them. I know. We've got a brand new red, and then we also have a purple. Purple. What makes this broom different? Well, as you can see right away, it's a complete system. So I have one right here because uh. you're getting the broom, you're getting the pan, and you're getting the wall mount here because it's less than a pound, so it's super lightweight. Okay. But I'll take you down to the floor and show you the real magic Great. because this broom is special. And like you said, we've we've had brooms since the caveman days, okay? Right. So first of all, we've got that great pan. We've got the whisk less than a pound, telescopes out two and different it's a times. Metal pan or mm -hmm. a, a metal wand on it. Yes. And this thing is virtually indestructible. It really is. So unlike conditional sweeping where you're going back and forth, the wisp is more of a raking mechanism. So you can see on the floor I've got All a right. lot of debris. It looks like we had a party with some cereal and some <laughs> confetti here. I'll push my dustpan up. I'm going to step on it and give and, it a little bit of way, pressure. And by the way, she is putting her foot on this for a reason. It's mm -hmm. changing the flex angle so that you don't get that usual line of dirt that's associated with a dustpan. Exactly, so take a look at this. I'm gonna take one sweep with that whisk, yep. one hand. In fact, the less effort I use, the better it works, and all of that dust, all of that debris, all of that cereal is Clean. inside my pan, no longer on that floor. What a concept. Unbelievable, right? Most dustpans always leave mm -hmm. the line. Yes. Always. Yeah. Now, here's where it really excels. That was bigger, chunkier stuff. Got it. Now we've got fine ground coffee. This could be flour. It could be in my home pet hair. It could be. Watch how effective this is when we start talking about the tough stuff to Well, pick exactly. Up. And I want you to hang on to the whisk for one it. second. Feel how lightweight it is. We all have these brooms at home, these conventional ones. They tatter, they fray. And when you sweep, you're sweeping back and forth. You're actually sending that dirt and debris back up in the air. So okay. this is the old school broom here. You have that sweeping mechanism where you're going back and forth. All you're doing is sending that all over the place, making a huge mess. Right. When I take that whisk, it's got a 90 degree angle to the floor, one pass coming through. Look at how much more control I have over that coffee. That's completely That clean. fine particulate, exactly. Two sweeps, and I don't have this mess over here from my conventional broom. This is because of the bristle seal technology, and I'll show you that. It's a lot of short, dense fibers that create that 90 degree angle to the floor that help you channel that dirt. We took out all those bristles you don't need and only left what you do need. Kylie, I have seen vacuum cleaners, expensive vacuum yes. cleaners, mm -hmm. that can't get a hard floor surface like this right. that clean. Exactly, but that's what you can expect with the whisk because this really is a much more special broom. Now, you've got the new purple. Yes, uh, which people, is People like their cleaning tools to be mm -hmm. decorative now. Yeah, yeah. So we've got that, we have the brand new color, which yes. is the red as well. Right. But we don't have a lot of the, either one of those. The red and the purple are really, really limited. I know, I was so excited. And I actually just saw them for the first time today and they're gorgeous. We took the best selling colors for your kitchen and your household and we made them into the broom. So I love the red, I love the purple. I always loved the gray and the blue, but these are exciting. Now, the one thing I do want to show you, now this is a whole system here. So okay. it's housed inside of itself. So you can see this is protecting the bristles. And then you also, by the way, every time you rest a, a broom with the bristles down, you create undue pressure on it, right. which you shouldn't. This right. will hang upside down. It does come with a wall mount takes up a little, little bit of space. Sure, I mean, it, it collapses down to virtually nothing, so you can actually put this underneath your cabinets. But I want to show you the back of it here, because this is what is actually creating that pressure seal to keep this intact. Okay. If I try to pull this apart, I can't actually budge this, and it was designed that way to protect these bristles so that the system stays in place. Okay. When you get this home, Wisp was nice enough to put stickers on it. We also have a video online, because this is the only thing they have to learn about it, but it's super easy. You're going to pull down on the dustpan, and that's right. going to move that pressure off of here. That's how you disconnect. Great. To connect it, and I'll flip it around for you, you put this in, you snap it into place, and that's it, and it's safe and sound in there. Just pull down, take it apart. Wonderful. In, snap it into place. I like this demonstration. Yes. Now, it, it, here we are, middle of June. 
Uh, but Christmas in July will be popping up soon. Yes. So we took Christmas ornaments mm -hmm. and we smashed them up on a tile floor. Right. Uh, one little shard of glass guaranteed to find it when you're in bare feet. Well, and this so let's is, get them all. This is a Christmas ornament. Yeah, but this just happened to me last week because it's summertime. We're having those parties. There's a lot of beer. Did you bottles, drop a glass or a bottle? And I dropped okay. a glass. I dropped a glass and it shattered everywhere. And I have those two dogs. So with my wisp. Now again, the less pressure I use, the better it works. Yep. One little sweep. If I don't get it all, I can slide my dustpan in, and there it is. And if, you got it all. Got it all, even in the nooks and crannies. If one shard of glass was left on here, it oh, would we'd be find on our it. hands. Exactly. Yeah, but it, there's just nothing there. All safe and sound in the wisp. So a broom that really does do mm -hmm. the job. Exactly. Exactly. Now, not only for your hard floors, okay. we have some carpet here. And I know what you're thinking. You're looking at this and you're saying, Kylie, you're crazy because this looks clean. Well, I've known you for a while. I know. <laughs> <laughs> you know I am a little bit crazy. Yeah, this but... actually doesn't look like it has any dirt in it at all. Exactly, exactly. But this is the other thing that the Wisp is actually really special with. Now, you have a menagerie at your house. Yes, we do. As do I. So, when I take this down to the carpet, I'm simply going to glide the Wisp over my carpet because it's awesome for that, too. Now, what's happening, it's making really awesome oh. Oh. lines in my carpet but it's creating, well, you're creating static an electrostatic look charge. at this look look at what it picked up and even you can see that static going right I never yeah but finger. I never even saw that exactly. hair on that rug exactly and it's funny because I pull my wisp out every day swear okay. to God every single day and even after I vacuum now you have greyhounds I have two greyhounds do greyhounds shed they do okay all they right. tell you that they don't but they really but they do, do. But, but but watch this on the videotape you'll see it the way you get things off the bottom of your your really effective broom is there's these tiny right little there. teeth on you the see it side right there. That clean of the wisp. the wisp pan. Yeah, yeah. So all of those things that you don't want to touch, that fur, that dirt and debris, you don't have to touch it anymore. You're not bending over. This is just so lightweight, so easy. You know, we made it this way on purpose so it would make life easier for you. And that's that's all we want. Exactly. We still call them chores. I know. It doesn't have to be a chore. It's not. It's actually quite fun sweeping with this. And this is a broom that, that you're going to be using all year round because it's not really a broom. It's a wisp. It's, it's, yep. it's a new design. I can show you that comb here live so you can see. It's on the side. There's actually one on each side of it. So it doesn't matter if you're left-handed, right-handed. Exactly. So I can take this through. I can use that comb to scrape off all of that pet fur. Take a look at all of that nice. gunk that now I don't have to touch. It's all in that pan. The red is the most popular, it's also the most limited. The red is the brand new color. Purple we just added to our yes. ass assortment as well. Sorry, I've got Pardon a little me. obstacle course there you go. for you. But for you, it's your dog food. Yes. My dogs never miss dog food. But yeah. the kitty litter, cats kick litter out of the box on purpose. I know, I know. The I cat will go. Well, let the human get that. I have two of these. I have one upstairs and downstairs because my litter box for the cat is upstairs and it lives next to it. I'm telling okay. you, every single day I take it out. I haven't found anything better for that. But yeah, the dog food, the fine particulates, all of those little things that we're, we're missing right. that you, you know, it's every day. So when I take that wisp, Now again, just a subtle step little, on the wisp pan exactly. changes that angle and gets all of it creates that pressure, so it creates that great seal. Okay. You can see it, it barely takes any pressure at all that I'm using, but here's what I love. So my wisp, it's like a raking mechanism. One pass in, I've got all of that dog nice. food. I'm not going back and forth. I'm not bending down. Everything's safe and contained. There's a nice ledge on the pan, so you know it's keeping all that dirt, all that debris in there. I'm you impressed. Love it. I know, I know. It's so smart. Well, dust pans, again, you, you fight with that line of dirt sure. that always builds up right where the edge is. You don't need to do that. It, can know, I make this tougher on you? I can, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite part of this demo. Step, really step on them, though, because when things get on the floor, the kids don't just drop the, the crackers and the pretzels. No. They stomp all over them, and that's what happens with it. So we have a fine particulate now. We have mashed up pretzels. Now, you made my job harder. So you can see one hand. I can take it. I can move it this way. I can go back and forth. I could talk on the phone while I'm still doing this. But the best part is stepping on that dustpan, all this fine particulate, it's making it way in if it doesn't I slide it right back I can take that a second time keep going and you're keep good going and that's that's getting rid of all that line but you're not bending over yep with with that old school dustpan and broom anymore it's a better animal uh, this is a purple right yes okay so the purple Purple's also beautiful. brand new beautiful this one is the gray there's the blue yeah I want to take you back to this one again sure. because you don't normally think of a, a broom of any kind for carpeting no but if you have pet hair if you've 
ever try to get pet hair up with a regular sure. broom, you can't do it. With this, you can. And not only for carpeting, for our couches, for ottomans, for everything. Okay. Like my cats and dogs, I tell them not to go up there, but they always do. Of course. The vacuum doesn't always get it because it gets embedded in some of the material. It's the same thing with the carpet. So, so you go very lightly, yeah. you go back and forth. Yeah, and I can use one hand with this. Not a lot of pressure, and like I said, in fact, the less pressure I use, the better the whisk works. First of all, look at the groom line. So it's actually making okay. it beautiful. I'm going to flip this look, over look, look. and show you what that you whisk did. You can see the did. static. Exactly. So it's picking up pet hair all the way across. Mm -hmm. Electrostatic charge, and this is what you can expect on your floor as well. I am always amazed at the amount of pet fur this pulls now, up Kylie, that I don't even see. I, I, let's say I don't want to touch that pet hair with my fingers to get it off, so what do you do? Well, so you can see on, on our whisk pan right here, yep. I have that fur that was left over from before. Nice little comb here, so I can take it, step on it, and this is gonna help clean it. Give it a little couple scrapes there, and all of that stuff I didn't want to touch is and going to be on that pan. Wonderful. By the way, we mm -hmm. now have about 400 left in the brand new red. The red has been very, very popular. Yeah. We've got the brand Beautiful. new purple as well. Have the blue and the gray. They are called the Wisp, the articulated broom and...